All right, I got this barrels calculator. Uh, I really didn't know anything about these things. Even didn't even know they existed really until I bought the the comptometer, which that's a beast, and restored it. I got it off a friend that had a bunch of stuff, but uh. And I took it apart and cleaned it inside and painted the lettering on it white because it's raised a lettering front and back. Used a toothpick to put the paint on. Uh, took the badging off and polished it. Painted the plate under, all, removed all the keypads and done all that to it. But anyway, to get back to the burrows. I got online since that was missing some numbers. I ended up buying some numbers that don't, that's not octagonal. Uh, that's round that I'm going to put on that to, for the like 15 or 16 missing keys and bad shape keys. But I got on eBay and found this machine and, and uh, it was a reasonable price and it had all the numbers which I was amazed even has the legs that goes on the back that throw that threads on to uh, make it set up at an angle you know higher and it's optional you can you can fix the back just like the front but the the seller had those off because so it would fit in a large flat rate priority shipping box but yeah I took this thing apart it works I didn't know if it was going to work or not but this is the better machine of the two. I mean, the numbers work so good and smooth. And, uh, it's just, to me, I think it's a better better machine quality-wise. Now, that's not to say the other one works fine. But this one just works, I mean, it works smoother. This is a smoother adding machine, smoother operating. Uh, I mean, you know, it's just, you can see here, these are just, and then to reset it, just pull that, and it resets, but yeah, I really like this machine, it's, it's cool, it's very good condition, serial number, uh, under a million so i'm gonna look up and see when it was made but yeah i really like these things i don't know what something like this would cost if they tried to make it today but i got lucky finding this one because it's original complete all the videos i'd watched on um youtube they was missing the keys and stuff some of them some of the keys are missing this one has all the keys which that was really what got me looking for the keys for that one and they do use the same keys it appears um, but yeah I'm gonna find the year I'll put it back together and show you I had to use this to get it to part because uh, they use a lock up here on the front and I got online trying to find out how you unlock it and it said sometimes you can overcome it with something thin and metal and two inches long. Well, it don't have to be two inches long in this case. Very short. And you just pull, I just pulled the latch over and it it, like, it goes around that little pin. That's all it is. It's a little, little uh, locking mechanism. Which I'll show you right here. Just that little lever there. But... <clears throat> I use some kind of little round keys what it used originally but you pull these two things out the side you sun thread them and it the top comes off makes it very easy to service get to now the comp comptometer or comptometer however you want to say that um, you gotta take screws out of it and stuff take it apart take the handle I mean it's just this one's much easier but I'll put it back together and then do a follow-up here to show you what it looks like together and operating all right and here's the barrels calculator back together uh, you can see I put the legs on it it's, this is a, such a nice machine to be original 
Um, let's see, I'll show you here it working. Let's see, start out with sample one. You add three and then nine up here. Nine up there, see how it carries over. Just to really, and then to reset it. it just works so smooth. Let's see. The buttons on this one, I'm going to put all nines in here. There you got all nines. Um, you had one. Getting nines up here right now, in case you don't know. Yeah, they don't build stuff like this anymore. <laughs> 